speak to Gustav, phone to Gustav, Gustav is happy. Dude, it's a fish! It's a live fish! Here, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Gas Station Simulator. I'm your mate, and today, well, today we are back in the desert. Today we are back at my humble establishment. Today we are back at making money. Some real, real money. You probably noticed that, well, I, you have a lot of money in you. I know, I've worked very hard for that thing. I don't know why this thing is over here. It's not supposed to be over here. Uh! I hit it, I don't know why it flew off. So yeah, okay. As you can see, we had a bit of a <laughs> we had a bit of a disaster uh, between the episodes. But also, I took my sweet time. I I cannot open trunks if I loaded just the game, so that's like a issue. Uh, but anyway, this gentlemen, basically, I decided to take my sweet time. I decided to farm a little bit the money. I've decided to expand a little bit. I've decided to change a little bit the shelves inside of my gas station. So as you can see, we got cigars over here, like a big shelf. Uh, ice cream two, ice cream one, we got uh, drinks, we got alcohol, we got uh, Carker, we got what we got over here, we got newspapers, we got snacks, we got all the good shit I went with this thing because when I had like those Lots of those little shelves Everything was constantly stuck. It's a new beautiful morning on my station And I'm actually wondering because I got you know, I've I've got it quite the money I've I'll be honest with you. I've got it quite the money and I want to invest this money I want to actually buy something cool. I want to actually oh, I can actually get the glasses as well. Uh, let's get the hat stand uh, Okay, so shelves because I kind of need to increase the amount of <laughs> hats that I'm selling around here How can I do this thing like that? Oh my god a bit faster. Thank you. Uh, sure, put it over here. Beautiful. Uh, so that's gonna be one thing. Now, can we actually upgrade some of the stuff over here? I can upgrade the car wash only. So if I want to upgrade the actual gas station, I need to fulfill the challenge. The challenge is bullshit. I need to fuel 100 cars. I need to serve 250 customers. I need to repair 25 cars. And I need to receive 100 tips. The tips, I guess, is the least of my concerns. The remaining ones? Oh, it's pain in the ass. Can I maybe please upgrade at least the uh, the employee cards? I mean, the wagon thingy trailers. Can I? Please tell me I can. Oh, thank God. Welcome. Welcome to the, I don't know, to the shoot call, I guess. Okay, cannot get any more. So, let's hire actually somebody. Uh, both of your salary sucks. Okay, whatever. Hire you. Okay, welcome aboard, my new friend. So, pay you, all of you. Now, I need you to start doing some actual job around here. So, you're gonna go and you're gonna do... What exactly you can do? Do I want you to handle the car register? Probably no. Fuel the car... No, wait, the other guy's gonna fuel the cars. Fuck it, handle the register for now. You're gonna go and do car repairs and you're gonna go and you're gonna try to do... Uh, fueling the cars. There you go. You guys get to work, and I, in the meantime, I'm gonna open up this entire joint. There you go! Hey, see? See them? <laughs> see, them? see them running to their positions? Faster, maggots! Faster! I also bought myself a collection of hats, because why not? There we go. And I'm gonna be selling this thing for good money. Oh, yeah! Whoa! -ho -ho -ho. I can actually buy more, by the way. Uh, let's see. Put the, put the other stuff on the shelves. Such as this thing, maybe. Uh, okay, there we go. Can I put some more? Yeah, I should be able to squeeze more, right? Beautiful! Look at this thing! Shelves full, full of goods, full of resources, full of stuff for me to sell! Okay, cannot put the ice cream, apparently. Uh, I'm actually thinking about getting myself some more shelves. Oh, yeah, also, hold on. Uh, we got, we got the money, so, you know what, would be cool to have. Let's get the glasses. Yeah, that's some good shit. That's how, that's how we're gonna make some real money around here. Uh, can I actually put this thing over here? Please tell me this thing is gonna actually fit. Can it fit, please? Beautiful. Right, now we just have to buy some glasses. So, delivery. Pro actually, car parts. We need some car parts as well. Uh, car wheels? Yes, please. How much space do I have? A lot. So, buy like 20 of those. That should be fine. Uh, those things, let's see, like 15, I guess. I can afford it <laughs> at this point. No problem. 
11 of those. Uh, engine oils. In stock I have 5, so let's get 10. Batteries. Add to cart. Let's get like 10 of those as well. Beautiful. Okay, order them. Delivery products, glasses. Let's see. I got those things in stock? I don't know how that thing happened. Okay, can I get those? Yes, I can. Okay, good. Uh, newspapers, snacks, cold drinks, alcohol. I don't think I need any else of those, right? Yeah, we got shitloads of alcohol, by the way. Uh, no need to get that thing. No need to get against the cigarettes. Car products are okay. Ice creams are okay. Yeah, I think I'll be fine for the timing. So yeah, order this thing. Beautiful. I wasted a bunch of money, but I'll make that money soon enough back. There's only one little problem when it comes to this, because... Oh wait, actually when my employees do it, they actually, this thing also counts. I think, right? Because I just, I just think speaking speaking to repair the car, but I'm not getting any tips. Yeah, car fuel it, okay, that's working. Shop customer served. Is that actually going up? Oh wait, I'm supposed to, I forgot to close the warehouse. <laughs> Very funny. Uh, okay, so 143 customers served. Anybody wants to buy anything? Come on, don't be shy. Also, there's like, there's lots of junk. <laughs> Why there's so much junk? Uh, okay, get that shit, get that shit, get this shit. All of the good shit. There we go. Now grab the, grab the, grab the brush. Brush, brush, brush. Oh no. Oh no. Here we go again. Here they come. <laughs> Here come the lunatics. No! Oh, please! Anything but that! <laughs> Why the lot of god not so bad again? No, oh, I'm so tired of those fuckers! Grab this, get outside, and front over here. Okay, please tell me- yes, okay, so if uh, my employee actually co serves the customer- oh no, here we go again. Serves the customer and actually get this thing towards the challenge. Thank god! Right, so, just keep fulfilling the wishes of the customers and we'll be fine. Also, why there's so much junk around here? There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Of course, I'm the only guy who's gonna be doing actual cleaning around here because reasons. Oh my god, the FPS. What's happening? Huh? Oh my god, some doubting guy's crashing my PC. Oh no, oh shit. And did you remember, I've spent so much money uh, on like actual, you know, upgrading and, and, and buying new supplies and stuff like that and I almost got back <laughs> to the starting position when it comes to my money. This is, this is how easy endgame money uh, looks like in this game. This, this is just ridiculous at this point. I am making money by just standing still and looking pretty. And I look very pretty in this dress. Uh, okay, hello, can I actually... Okay, you are already leaving, so I'm not even going to attempt to... You guys are also leaving. The worst thing is that eventually my guys are gonna get tired, so I have to do anything on my own. With honest, to be honest with you, I actually prefer to, to close the... the station and just wait for them to rest. That's like a better solution than that. Uh, put it back here. Okay, uh, replenish the tires. There we go. Replenish the mirrors. Okay, actually we need to get some more of those. So, sure. Go to the go to the deliveries, products, car parts. Let's see. Also, oh, wait, 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 wait. I forgot about those things. Press all. Okay, we can get 10 of those. Yeah, we can we can get a bunch more of those resources, I guess. Uh, how many? Okay, let's get, let's get like a bunch of tires, by the way, as well. So tires, at, 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 batteries. Okay, here we go. So, car engines. Let's see. I need 50 of those. Like this. I need, let's say, 16 car engines. Oil. Uh, mirrors. Make it 20. Just we have to look out for the maximum stock I have. Make 16 of those. And let's get 10 tires or something. There you go. Beautiful. 4,000 cash! And I'm still gonna make that money back. I've opened up one of the car trunks and it'll give me a magic wand. The heck I'm supposed to do with that? Uh, no. Card parts? No. Cards? The fuck is this? Can someone please explain what the heck I'm supposed to do with this? Oh, the magic wand! <laughs> I have no idea what that thing is for. I really have no idea. Okay, you take care of the fuel. I'm gonna take care of the of the truck. Okay. 
No, I'm talking about the car, not the lady. There we go, thank you. Okay, what about you? Do you have something cool in your trunk? Let's see, how do you open it? Sesame, open, come on, give me your secrets, give me, give me your stuff. No, not like that. Not like that. Bingo, thank you. <laughs> hey, it's six dollars, man. You're not going to c complain about free money. Uh, okay, car wash. Yeah, sure, I can take care of the car wash, why not? Morning, how would you like to clean your car? You need to clean as well? No, I don't have a seizure, what you talking about? This is effective car cleaning. <laughs> Works every single fucking time. You just keep rolling around. Also, I don't know when the developers added this, because I either I'm blind or I'm getting just old. But they've added like this shit. You can actually press the button and the game's gonna tell you like, listen, asshole. This is, this, those are like the dirty parts. This is what you have to clean. I don't know when they added this. I have no clue. I honestly don't. So, uh, if this thing was ready in the game, I am so terribly sorry. <laughs> I am so terribly, terribly sorry. But at this point in the game, sadly, that's, that's basically it. You have to fulfill lots and lots of orders. Lots of lots of customer service, lots of lots of fueling, uh, washing, repairing, deliveries, Whoa, accepting super. deliveries, ordering deliveries and stuff like that. Yeah, you need to do all of that, those things from the challenge list in order to upgrade the station to the last final tier. It takes a while, yes. Is it worth it? I don't know, you tell me. Awesome. At this point, I'm not quite sure, but I, I am making a lot of money. <laughs> I am making tremendous amounts of money. I'm actually considering getting myself on my very own fuel station, uh, I mean gas station, in the middle of the desert. I mean, if this is the money you can make with the with this type of establishment, then I don't know why I'm wasting my time doing those videos. I mean, honestly, by now I would have my very own mansion in the middle of the of the Caribbean or something like that. Next, please. Move your sorry ass woman out of here, thank you. Also, I still don't understand why they still have Christmas hats. Like, this is long time past Christmas and they still have Christmas hats, at least on the day when I'm recording this, so... Maybe, maybe it's something wrong with me. I mean, there's a lot of things wrong with me. This is probably one of them. Hard to say at this point, I guess. That'll do. There we go. Okay, I need to get seven more tips and I'm gonna actually fulfill my own personal challenge. Uh, but the remaining ones? Well, I'll just let my, my guys do it. You know how it is, boys, right? I'm paying you for a bloody good reason, okay? I'm paying you for... I'm paying you to make me money. That's how catapultism works. It always works that way. You mean they've lied to us on university? Yeah. Yeah, that's what you get for picking shitty college degrees. Uh, let's see. Okay, you are not in the car, so I can actually... Oh, that's another thing. You really should learn how to lockpick cars. <laughs> Oh, a stick bomb. I love that card. And I just fulfilled my very own personal challenge, so now I just have to wait for my guys to, to rest completely, so I'll be able to, well, you know, sit, sit back and relax and just see how my, how my account in the Caribbean grew. <laughs> it's gonna grow, because I'm gonna make so much money out of it. <laughs> this establishment is making me lots and lots of money. I've paid it off my uncle. I don't have any, any, any interactions with the local mafia. What I can say, life is beautiful. At this point, Life is pretty. It's full of sand, but it's still pretty. And the best part about this is that when you actually start to make some money, when you actually become successful, you know, you worry about your the people that work with you. You worry about, well, everybody around, right? You worry about the guy that works at the fueling the cars. You worry about the guy that repairs, repairs the cars. You worry about the guy that actually handles the, the cars register. And then you worry about Gustav. Gustav, here! The fuck is wrong with you? That's a fish. Come on. What? You don't like fish? Are you serious, man? Think to Gustav. Fall to Gustav. Gustav is happy. Dude, it's a fish. It's a live fish. Here. You can't be serious with this shit. <laughs> Motherfucker doesn't like any fish. <laughs> oh, bullshit. And of course, from time to time you get an attraction in form of a fucking dust storm. Because why not, right? Just when you think that things will just go along smoothly, everything's gonna be alright, everything's gonna be okie dokie, you get a motherfucking sandstorm on your face. Uh, you know what, guys? You do this shit, I am way too tired. <laughs> I am not going to start here when this shit hits the station. I am going into my little bunker on the... on the... on the... On the... When did this thing get improved? When I got a balcony, by the way? 
Wow. That's new. I was never... Actually, I'm, I'm still waiting for the moment when the game will allow me to get some proper furniture around here. <laughs> Where's my furniture game? Ah, shit. Hello, sir. I mean, miss. How are you doing today? Because we have a very special offer just for you. You are a 250th customer. Really? What day with? Well, lady, we have some very special rewards for people like you. For example, we got this trash bag. Here. Ah. You can take it with you! Where are you going? You forgot the reward! Here, catch! <laughs> Lovely! Upgrade the gas station to level 5. You need to complete all the challenges to unlock the upgrade. I... I... I think I did it. I honestly think I did it, boys. We finally got the gas station to its maximum, at least for the time being, level. Unless the developers are gonna plan to do something very fancy that I'm gonna regret later on. I don't know, we'll see. So basically what you need to do is gas station, more information. Would you like to upgrade this joint? Yes, please. Customer uh, toilets, parking slots, employee trailers, war paint service, more decorations, structure upgrades, and the vacuum. I have no idea what the vacuum is for. I'm I can just guess, but okay, whatever. Let's give... Oh yeah. Oh, it looks so good. <laughs> Hi, the officer. How are you doing? Oh, I got a phone call. Answer the phone. Oh my God, Uncle's running. I wonder if he does. He wants to congratulate me on the well-done job that I actually brought this joint into well, a proper I must success. Admit, the progress you are making is something to admire. There's no shame in calling you more than family, a business partner. But still. You owe me some cash, don't you? Relax. Once you have the money, just call me. No rush this time. Oh, great. Now I have to just give him money because... Because reasons, apparently. Great. Great. I'm a big fan. I'm, I'm a really big fan. Oh, I got lots of space behind me right now. Whoa. <laughs> okay, this thing is not supposed to be here, by the way. Can I move... Can I move my... Thing a little bit closer, please? Because this how now doesn't have any sets. The gas station have expanded into random directions, apparently. Oh well, whatever. Whatever, we can just focus on uh, upgrading the stuff. Yeah, I have to... Uh-oh. Oh, don't tell me that this thing is gonna be stuck in the wall now. Don't tell me that this is gonna be the thing. No, please! Not this shit! No, 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 no. How the heck I was supposed to know that this thing is gonna expand to... Okay, thank God. I thought... Nope, sorry! <laughs> Coming through! Oh, peace. No, 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 no. You go into the container. Into the container you go. Come on. There we go. Thank you. Same goes for you. Ah, peace and quiet. Right. Get those morons to, to actually do the proper job. So you're gonna be... Uh, task list. Okay, handle ledger there. Task list. You're for repairing the cars. And you're, of course, gonna be doing fueling the cars. Ah, peace and quiet. Okay, so there are like any other upgrades we could try to get. The car wash, warehouse, workshop. Sure. And there is nothing else. At least for now. I'm actually wondering what's gonna give me the upgrade of the of the workshop. So let's let's just press the button. Spark block exchange. Oh really? Sure, why not? Yeah, I needed to upgrade the entire building just to get access to this shit. I'm so proud. Uh, okay, is there anything else we could try to upgrade? Car wash, car wash. Why the car wash have so many levels? Increase pump durability. Do I really need this? Maybe? I don't know. At this point, it's really hard to say. say. Uh, emails. Let's see. That's it. Good luck. Oh, congratulations, my dearest nephew. With the transfer to debt paid off, we even. And as I see, when you were busy paying off the debt, your station grew into the quite a little jewel of the desert. I'm proud of you, nephew. I'm guessing business does run the family after all, but don't think you're done. You're the boss of your own property now, and you're balancing the preciously thin line between... Uh, be the thin line even more than you did when you started. There's still a lot of things out there in the desert, both in the wilds and with the people. So keep your eyes open, and who knows? <laughs> really just began. Someday you might face changing or even more challenges never seen before. Who knows what the future might bring. If this thought is exciting, admire your enthusiasm. If this is terrifying, that means you grew up to become a real business owner. I heard that some folk who have taken interest in the region too. Maybe we'll see something big coming up from the next 
from <laughs> from them in the near future. Listen, as the savvy business owner, I'd say you should keep uh, an eye out. Here's some links to check out <laughs> when you have time. <laughs> Clever developers. Uh, ain't got a clue. Well, nephew, even I don't know how to make sense of this one. The package with the, that new toys toy of you came with with no sender, no list of contents. It's just 51 sign on the side. I had my lads try to decipher whatever instructions for the side of that thing, but only they only came up with, uh, well, why don't you have a read? The projector can be set up to fire highly concentrated pull forces in the two configurations. What? The pull force would drag any variables? What the fuck is this shit? <laughs> what I got this equipment, by the way? I got... I got a package. Where's my package? Wait, hold on. What? Uh, excuse me? Did I get a package? I'm supposed to worry about this? Ah! Great, I've paid the 5,000. Should I really have paid that thing? Probably no. Oh, there's something over here. What the fuck is that? Who the fuck is this guy? Game? Oh yeah, that's that's the uncle. <laughs> Here's the money. So my regards to the uncle. Nice doing business with your kid. Yeah, well, I can't say likewise. Oh, that's a nice teddy bear you have over there. Hey, Pong! This place you've got here is amazing. And you've got all the money? Great. That's mighty kind of you. Best of luck, and... Hope I want to have the comic here all angry and everything. Forget to tell you, boss left you a little something should help you with the little twerk. Go check out your parking area. Peace. What the seven fucks is that supposed to be? Dennis Defense Siren. <laughs> Dennis Defense. That's what I have paid 5,000 for? For Dennis Defense Siren? What the fuck is this? Wow, that's a barrel! <laughs> I'm supposed to do something with this barrel? <laughs> and I guess the final thing to upgrade actually is the warehouse. Because, well, reason this will allow me to, to get more stockpile. Oh yeah! And this will increase the cost the size of my house! Which, <laughs> which is a win-win in my book, because, well, now... I can try to get myself some bitches. Can you? Probably no. <laughs> but hey, <laughs> it was at least worth trying, right? Uh, did something actually change over here? Oh, I got a rifle. Uh, <laughs> I got a funny rifle. It took the game a while to give me a rifle. <laughs> Thank you. Oh no. Uh, here we go again. Subnautica, here we go. Basically, the I think that this this is the point where I'm gonna leave this this episode as if, as it is for now over here. I can I cannot already speak English because I'm <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs> I have been recording a few videos in a row. That was a, that's a never good idea. But anyway, the thing is that well, we did the majority of the, of the things, right? We we fulfilled I guess the campaign. We finished the the campaign. Uh, I've upgraded the, the gas station to its maximum level. The only thing I can actually do right now is to get more shelves, get more products. Uh, I still have to get like that one parking lot over there finished up, so I have to clean it up. Uh, I've actually managed to clean up this one, so we got more, more visitors. Uh, I've bought another fuel pump over here, so now I can actually fuel three cars at the same time. And of course we upgraded the workshop to its maximum level, and I've upgraded the warehouse to its maximum level. So when it comes to money making, I think we got everything upgraded and bought. The question is now, how much time I want to spend sitting over here and actually acquiring the money. But the thing is that, ladies and gentlemen, uh, the gas station simulator game, it has a few DLCs. Some of them are like basically mm, decorative DLCs, I guess, that they don't add much of a gameplay, but they add like a bunch of decorative stuff. But there's one upcoming DLC that I actually have my eyes on. Uh, that will allow you to somehow interact interact with the plane that constantly flies over my head. Yeah, so that's gonna be the thing, and I'm I'm guessing that's gonna add a variety of new new tools and options. So I'm looking forward to that thing. And also, there's another DLC called I think uh, Shady Deals or something like that, which is I'm guessing related to the gangster that I have paid the money to, the guy that works for the for the uncle. 
So the question is, what will those DLC bring? How much content they're gonna give? And how exciting they're gonna actually be to play? Because for now, I don't think there's gonna be uh, anything more like story related. For now at least, I'm guessing there's gonna be just, you know, issues that we have to take care of. Uh, but it will all go down to one single subject. Basically, acquiring huge amounts of money. Is that true? Probably. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. But that's gonna think, gentlemen. man. I'm gonna actually do for the future episodes. If you wanted to try the game yourself, link in the description below. As always, you can also add the DLCs to your wishlist, so feel free to do so. And, well, I think I'm just gonna play a little bit offline. Um, I mean, off-screen. And try to acquire some huge amounts of money, so we're gonna be actually prepared for the upcoming DLC. But that's gonna be thing I'm gonna actually worry about in the future. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Thanks a lot. I'll see you in the next video.